This year's prize is about understanding the psychology of economics for its contributions to behavioral economics. And he's currently a professor of behavioral science and economics at the University of Chicago. Well, my cell phone rang at four in the morning and it said Sweden on the, on the phone, so I had a pretty good idea what that might be. I, I knew it could happen. You can never count on anything and you certainly never know when it might happen. My mantra is if you want to get people to do something, make it easy. Remove the obstacles. So if we want people to use less energy, figure out ways to make that easier. Taylor has shown, using theory and data, that psychology is critical in understanding how we make important decisions such as savings, investment, or labor supply. And he has shown that by influencing our individual decisions, psychology affects the prices we see in the market and the marketing strategies that firms follow in order to attract consumers. Even more important to get people to be saving, <clears throat> to be saving more for retirement. Um, Human economics has helped us learn a lot about how to do that. One simple way is what's called automatic enrollment. Now, this is just changing what are called the default options. In a typical 401k plan, when you first become eligible, you get a big pile of forms, and you're told fill out these forms if you want to join. Tell us how much you want to save and how you want to invest in it. Under automatic enrollment, you get that same pile of forms, but the top page says, if you don't fill out these forms, we're going to enroll you anyway, and we're going to enroll you at this saving rate and in these investments. If you don't want to join, then sign here that says, I don't want to join. That increases the number of people who join and the speed at which they join by a huge amount. There's a second component of a good savings plan. Save More Tomorrow is, is a nudge to help people do what they know they want to do, which is save more. But they can't bring themselves to save more now. Here's how Save More Tomorrow works. A company invites their employees to sign up for a plan where every time they get a raise, some part of that raise goes to increasing their contribution rate to the 401k. In the first company we convinced to adopt this plan, saving rates tripled. Now, no one was forced to do it, right? So this was a nudge. 